the school for my new poetry. Oh, is it? Congratulations! You are such a brilliant one. You deserve it definitely because you have such a skill for new creations. What did your teacher say about this award? Teachers have appreciated me in the assembly. They said I am proud to my school. Next year, I will be promoted to a new big school and fulfill my dreams. New big school? Lad, see your condition. We are very poor. We don't have any money for the continuation of your studies. Do you know our business is getting done? See, you have a little brother. We have to give him also good education. We are sure that your brother also will be brilliant like you. But unfortunately, we don't have the money for both of your education. But for all the teachers. See, you are a girl. And after some years, you should be married and go into someone's house. But your little brother, he is the only hope for us. So, it's enough for your studies and let the chance be given to your brother. Yes, lad. You do one thing. Help your father in making pots and sell it. You can also write from here. Because we are helpless. And this is our fate. Poor girl. In this very little age, she has to take a big burden of poverty and prevent her from her dreams. Yes. She has a big dream. To be a well-known writer. But, excuse me. Hey, mister. We have come here with the good news. Your life is going to be changed because of your child. Sorry? I can't understand anything. What do you talk about, my child? We are coming from Mr. Balram, the wealthiest person in the city. Unfortunately, they don't have any children so far. But they were always observing a child and wanted to have that child as their stepdaughter. Oh lucky child. Which is that child? That's your daughter, mister. This I have told you just before that your life is going to be changed. How can we send our daughter to someone's house? She is the only daughter for us. Our hope. No, we don't do such a thing in any case. Just listen. This is only for your goodness. Don't miss this chance. Now you think about it and inform us the next day. Did you hear what they said? To send our daughter. How can we send our daughter? No, we can't. But how will we look after our children if she is here? It is for her goodness and ours. Anyway, we can't take care of our children with the present condition. So I think we have to admit this opportunity. What do you think? I think you are correct. We can't go so far in this condition. Let our child be saved with someone. Her happiness is our happiness. I will inform them that we are ready for saving our daughter. Oh you! I thought you wouldn't come. Okay, get us the money fast that you offered. What's your name? Let's me. Take this. Keep your belongings there and start the work. Didn't understand? Keep your bag there and wash the dishes. After that, wash the clothes. Then I will tell you what you have to do. I gave them a huge amount for you. So do start the work, okay? Hey, hear no cry, no tears. Just do the works. We have admitted you as a servant. Now go and do the works. What's your name? Lakshmi. Rahul, how dare you to talk to this bloody creature? You still sitting here with your back? A diary? What is it? It's it's my life and dream. Life? Dream? 
Close your eyes and spread your wings. Make a wish and dream good dreams. Don't ever say you will never tell. Cause life is short and very free. Make a wish and dream good dreams. Who wrote this? M myself. You? No, never. I can't believe. I was awarded with this at the school for my poetry. Unbelievable. What a talent. What a creation. Sorry girl. It happened. I'm really sorry. You are a talented one. I know that you are blessed with the light of knowledge. Now onwards, you are not a servant, but a guide for us. I'm sure you can reach in a high position. For that, I assure you all my support. See, hear no cry and no tears, okay? ആനന്ദിക്കട്ടെ mm. 